right from the start. I knew I was bombing. I sounded big and phony, real the and now, and then I started rushing it. Hi, what's new in Denmark? I just couldn't get a hold of it. I just could not connect. And, uh, and while I'm up there, I look out and there's this kid in the third row, like, and he's yawning and he's jiggling his legs and he's reading his program and he was obviously dragged there. And I just wanted to say, hey kid, I'm with you. I can't stand this either. But I, I couldn't. I just kept feeling worse and worse. Just drowning. And I thought, okay, all my questions are answered. I'm not Hamlet. I'm no actor. What am I doing here? And then I get to the soliloquy, the big job. I'm right in the headlights. And I think, oh Christ, to hell with it. Just do it. To be or not to be. That is the question. Whether it is nobler in the mind to suffer the slings and arrows of outrageous fortune, or to take arms against a sea of troubles, and by opposing, end them. I, I, I kept going, I, I finished the speech, and I look out, and there's the kid, and he's listening. The whole audience, complete silence, total focus. And I was Hamlet. It lasted about ten more seconds, then I went right back into hell and I stayed there. But, for that one little bit, that one speech, I got it. I had it. Hamlet. And only 8,000 lines left to go.